The world is in trouble, so we want to make it a safe and happy place. We need to make a change. We have ocean pollution, littering, car pollution. It's really bad for the environment. Our project is Stop, Shop and Swap. So we basically get clothes and then sell them for free. We'll do it outside. We've chosen an amazing animal workshop. We're really just trying to help the animals living in bad conditions. Then we bought some hedgehog feed bowls, which were £5.23. As a young person, I think I can help everyone get de-stressed by making a sensory room in the school. I would say this project is very good. Instead of people wasting their clothes, they can give it to family, friends. If you recycle and you follow the good rules, this world can be a better place. The project's been really an eye-opening in terms of subject knowledge around the environment and global issues. I think the project's been brilliant in opening their eyes. This is my actual first clothes sale. I never thought that this much people were going to come. The thing that's like made me more like, you need to do this, and yeah, it's actually the people who came. It told me that if you keep on doing this, more people are even gonna come, and you just gotta work hard and believe in yourself. All right. I've learned about litter and how it affects animals, how they can get stuck in it, and I try not to litter anymore. I felt really astonished and happy at the same time because if we didn't launch that project people would be cold. Some specific children have gained so much from this project and just that rewarding feeling of when you help others because they're seeing the difference immediately. I've taken a step back and let them do it. So we'll have a parents section, a kids section. When this global action plan came out of like Wow, the world is like a really cool place. Sometimes the child with the smallest voice usually has the most valuable contribution through this project. They've ensured that everybody's voice is listened to and those children have been able to make that difference. When we were going to do the assembly, I was very shy. Um, but then I took a deep breath and I stepped in the hall and did everything I could, really. I want to keep everyone calm and live a happy life. I wasn't good at writing, but now when I wrote the leaflets, I, I actually became, like, more confident. My confidence level is, like, high up, so I feel like 200%. It's an invaluable experience for the children to feel that they can give back and make a difference to the world. It's huge for them. We love our sensory room! Yeah. One man's trash is another one's treasure. I think it's a great 10 out of 10 project.